Nation. Skyrim. I have, on the PlayStation 3 version, a level 80 Khajiit. Level, in fact, probably higher than level 80. Because I beat the level 80 boss. Uh, anyway. Procrastination aside, I think this area could use some carpeting. It could also use some floors that maybe don't have uh, all the vegetation from outside growing into it. I would like to back up, please. I can't see where that's going. About like that. Well, I don't get why I drop down when I do that. It does not make sense that I drop down while doing that. Any second now, I'm going to hit the size limit. I gotta make my stylish resort ready for the people. The people of the Commonwealth should appreciate living in such a wonderful place. I mean, we have all the shopping amenities right here. If I could see where the carpet was going, I could adjust its position. Make sure it wasn't crooked. It's weird, it sounds like I'm picking up a floor. Oh, wait, why am I picking up both carpets? I think I laid this over that one, that's why. Have some nice carpeting that's completely misaligned. And that would be the order of placing things right there. And a lot of building games get finicky about which order you place things. One of the games I was considering playing, but unfortunately my PC is dead, was, was I think the one that's being sued right now. I never got around to it because I think that's mostly a server based game. I don't know why these don't light up better. Look at how dark it is down there. I thought those would light better. We need more lights. If I don't move too much... Forget it, I have to move. That's not powered. Um, my guess is if I do this, you don't like being on the seams? All the other ones, every last one of the other ones is on the seam. And there we go, lit up. These will definitely be out of alignment, is my guess. A 
I'll probably have to move that. Nothing more can be built. I'm pretty sure that's what it said. I missed the actual dialogue box. Let's try to make a few adjustments. It's kind of a dark corner, but I don't think I can fit one there. I find this game somewhat enjoyable. The combat's pretty good, too. I just really wish it quit glitching out. I haven't even showed 10% of the glitches. And if you ever decide to mod Skyrim, be careful with the armor mods because I ended up with my armor randomly not existing because I was getting one shot Daedric armor. And from what I understand, that's a virtual impossibility if it's enchanted. Especially since I only play on normal. Some people might find that boring, but I find normal to be more enjoyable than die every five seconds. Well, this is thoroughly terrible. Let's go get the... Go find a unused bed. Sleep. 1 a.m. 2. About to there. I never did like the fact that changing the time actually took this long. That's why I don't like waiting or sleeping in Bethesda games. It takes time. In Sanctuary, it takes six times that. Maybe eight times that. Well, here's our special resort. If you work, you eat. I've done that. more work in a few days here than you've done in your entire existence. There's my giant fountain that looks like a UFO. I did not intend that. Wow. From right here, I've got a UFO crashed on there. Or landed on there. Our nice little resort. Walking around just outside the actual border of the town. Windows to shoot out of on the first floor. Although, this bedroom is probably the worst, because you will get shot. I don't even know why I put that there. I couldn't put up a wall here, though. It wouldn't let me. Huh? Just to show that, rather than tell that. Don't. Let's do this. We'll move this slightly out of the way. This. Now, if we stand on the bed, I have infinity billion steel by now. Oh, yeah, nothing more can be built. Of course I slipped my mind completely. Let's store you. You should give me the ability to build one wall. This would normally just lock into there. Oh, it actually gave me a spot for it. For a second there, the game was almost being reasonable. can't seem to move much. Oh, because I'm putting it, I'm not locking it in. 
Oh, well, there. That works. It didn't work before. I have no idea what's different now. shouldn't be anything different right now. It kind of makes the room a little cramped to have the bed and the chairs there. No, I don't want to store that. I do want to store that, though. Let's do that. It should let me... I don't know, might not let me build one more wall. Huh. I don't think so. Wow. At that weird angle it would let me build it, but not... What is it colliding with? It's got collision with something. This is how you end up building in this game. Where can I put it? Where can I put it? Where can I put it? And it breaks down to spam the damn button until I can place it. Well, that ain't gonna work, so I've got an option anyway. Freestyle adjustment of the room, and that's in my face. I'll put the toolbox back after I'm able to do the pistol trick. But I'm gonna have to pick up one more random toolbox. After I'm able to do the pistol trick, I'll put up new toolboxes in the exact same positions. Simply because when the game makes me do things like that, the first thing that goes through my mind is, well, screw you, I'll use the glitch to put it back. My settlement, I build it my way. You don't like it? Go fornicate with yourself. Oh wait, I know what I can put here. Let's put a mini bed. Probably about... Nothing more can be built. Of course. It's the timer. Means I got about 30 seconds to wrap it up. They honestly made the build limit a little too small, but I think that might have been something out of necessity in the game because of the lag it causes. I honestly hope they never get rid of the pistol trick that gets rid of the size, because otherwise then you, all building's going to be exactly the same. Every building's going to look the same. There will not be a single building that will be unique because there won't be enough room to work on it. Uh, that's just a ramble. And we're up to 25 beds, more than I could ever use. So, see you next time where we'll have a little bit of combat and possibly finish off the... Okay. I honestly forgot what the villain was in this DLC. Mechanist? Yeah, finish off the Mechanist. Have a good time, see you later, and take it easy.